Hello and welcome. The map we're checking out today is Maxima Basin. Welcome to Maxima Basin. Enjoy a quick trip to return a missing officer home. What could possibly go wrong? Based on a template map by Oratario Terraforming Tower 107. Thank you for the great template, Oratario. This is mostly an open range map with an overarching story to help guide you. Feel free to approach it however you want, but don't bite off more than you can chew. Primarily a low slash mid tech map, no marauders, no hoppers, no mark two, with lots of close combat to give E pulse a purpose. If you are used to sending lone units through already cleared areas in the fog of war, prepare for a surprise or two. There is a multitude of ways to cheese areas. If you find those ways, good on you. This is a long map. If you notice that your weapons appear to become less deadly, please quick save, wait for the save to complete and quick load to fix the bug inherent to the game engine. Please tell me if you find any errors that hamper story progress or create general weirdness. I never played Artario's original map since it isn't in the workshop, so any possible similarities are purely coincidental. I actually don't remember a terraforming tower map ever actually being released. I have been subscribed to the template map forever, as well as the Codes to Mars template map. And I've played Codes to Mars, obviously, but I don't remember a terraforming one ever actually being released. So... If it was, I sure never saw it, but I've been covering this game for a long time. So, to me, any story in this is going to be new. But all right, let's jump on in. Okay, we already read this. My head hurts, what a mess. I got thrown out during the crash. I was sent here to find General Paxton after weeks of radio silence, but for now, I should check the ship for survivors and see if it still works. That undoubtedly is a uh, Aliens reference. The overlap of Starship Troopers and Aliens is, uh, is pretty big. Fans of both, that is. All right, there are some survivors, but the ship is wrecked. We need a replacement. First, we need more troopers. Let's check the tents I saw before the crash. I saw MI banners there. Maybe someone is hiding from the bugs. Well... Normally, we would just do this and control move this way, but based on the description, I don't actually trust this map at all. So let's do this. Careful, there are bugs ahead. I also am not actually that big a fan of either of these units the pulse troopers or the marine raiders like sure the marines are more powerful than the standard rifle troopers and faster faster is the primary thing I like them for Wow, it meant it. Go south. The tent's over there. Too many bugs ahead north. Instantly pissed off a pack of tigers. Wow, okay. I guess we're reloading. Didn't even get to give my example. But yeah, they are faster, which is the thing I like, but the trade-off of them being fast but not having the grenades or the shotguns is not worth it to me. I would I would always rather just have a regular group of rifle troopers. Yes, sir. 
I don't trust this slope at all. Surely there is bugs up there. Oh, wow. Yep, I was right to not trust it. I hope that's it. I'll patiently wait for them to get their charge back. And Pulse Troopers are a little bit more tolerable when you have like four of them, so you can cycle through these abilities. But when you only have two, man, I would always just rather have some Mark IIs than them. Okay, all of that is up there. Will any of that come after me, though? Will, like, the sound of our battle attract any of them if we just go down here and see what this is about? Is anyone here, he says. That was too loud. Okay, we're gonna get attacked by a bunch of tigers now, apparently. Wow, the Pulse Troopers range is so garbage. They're able to just run right up on you with them. And soon, they're going to just run out and they can't fire anymore. Now the bugs run? Oh my god. This is a... This is a weird intro. Like, to make the player deal with this is the first thing they have to deal with. They should add an extra set of troopers at least. This is, uh... This is weird to make the player deal with this amount of, uh... Of a hassle this early. Don't know if that did anything. Did anybody die? No? Because if anybody died, it's gonna make this incredibly more difficult. So if I come at it from this angle, Presumably, they can just walk down at me from here. So where am I supposed to attack them from? Is the idea to do it from here? Uh, they did not pop out from the same location? That's weird. I mean, did I get it easy there? Because we, because they didn't pop out from here, maybe. Sir, Sir. 
Finally, someone is here. Good to see some brass on the ground. I have a radio, but I cannot reach anyone. We need to procure a dropship and establish contact with Fleet HQ. That dish up there looks interesting. That is a lot of tigers. <laughs> okay, map. All right. There's just that many tigers hanging out there, apparently. Man, this is going to be... This is gonna be a Planet K-like map, isn't it? Yes. I'm getting, I'm getting strong. Sir. Gonna be like Planet K vibes from Sir. this map already. Power up. Snipers. Rocket troopers, ready here. Sir. Yes, sir. sir. Roger that. Snipers. Roger that. Sir. Yeah, it kind of defeats the purpose of these barrels when you can't actually select them. When bugs are just covering them like that. Okay, that was unfortunate that the sniper just did that. We got a dropship calling Fleet HQ. Sir. Sir. This is Fleet HQ. We can read you. What's your status? This is Major Noklu on a mission to extract General Paxton from Maxima Basin. My ship was shot down. I have many wounded and I am low on supplies requesting assistance and orders. We understand your situation is difficult. Use the dropship you acquire to reinforce your units. We currently have no more to spare. Your orders remain unchanged. Sir. Rescue General Paxton when the bugs overran the station. His last communication said that he was going to take shelter in the prison. The prison gates need to be hacked open. Check the data center. Former MI Intel instructor Hackerman may be in deep hiding at the data center and help you. We heard you were... Okay. Thinking to self, he was on this planet. I had no idea. I hope he made it. We strongly suggest to search the missile base for supplies before pursuing your mission. Okay, that probably means that it's mandatory that you would not get far without extreme micromanaging without doing it. Be aware that Plasma Bug is probably shot down your ship. That probably shot down your ship is still active. Taking it down would be beneficial for your core mission. Understood, I am on the way. 
Yes, sir. Ready here. Roger that. Sir. Yes, sir. Sir, affirmative. Ready here. Affirmative. So it wants us to go here first, but really it's go to here, then to here, then maybe to these. Sir. Yeah, I mean, even though it said strongly suggest, I am sure already from the way this mission has been that it's mandatory unless you have the most the most efficient micromanaging possible. Which I have no interest in doing. I am not gonna be micromanaging to that degree if I can help it. We baited the plasma. Also baited a ton of tigers. At least maybe they're going to get blasted. That worked out well. I'm going to be using the Marines as our scouting party. Let's see if we can bait another blast. We did. Okay, cutting it close, but maybe... Maybe we can... Oh, that's not good. A unit has been 
units have been promoted, sir. Maybe, maybe that'll bait the plasma. It's baiting, it's baiting this somehow. got an idea maybe it'll work but maybe not we've got a unit under attack All these bugs that came down from here are making it a little bit more problematic, but... Okay, they closed it. But they got stuck. Well, that's irritating. They at least did it. But some random bug showed up on us somewhere. Trying again. Plasma launch detected. A unit has been promoted, sir. Sir, additional supplies are now available. Nope. Nope, we're not getting away with it. There's too much bullshit down there. Notice that the plasma is down, so we could send some supplies your way. However, it seems the bugs also noticed. Yes, 
We are going to be saving a lot on this mission. I can already tell. Are they going to make it in time? I don't know. They didn't. Okay, there's a tanker hanging around now. That's not good. Okay, we hit an autosave going over here. Or was it us going up this path a little? Alive, squad. Could be either. So the base is definitely up this path. Let's see, is there anything up here? Probably. Okay, there appears to be a nest somewhere up there. You know what? Fine. We'll go up here first. Because maybe we'll get some supplies or something. 
if we go up here because it looks like we're gonna actually get to be able to take a base that we can actually start bringing in new units from Well, that certainly is problematic. That was pretty close. I would not have enjoyed having to reload because of that. This is Fleet HQ. We have received log files from the missile base indicating potential locations. We are marking them on your map. Okay. This is actually... I know this map said... The description said you could go about it any way you want. But I feel like this is actually a big deal right now. If these are meant to be done in a specific order... ...and it doesn't tell us... ...this could potentially cause a lot of problems. Our war support has increased, sir. So, like, there's... ...this... 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 And this. Now, we could go down here and do this one, but then the player might be tempted to go down since this is the p the path of least resistance, since they've cleared all this out already. Travel down here and do these two, and then head up and do this one. But... That might not be the intended way. It might be intended to go here, around to here, and then down, and then over to here. And that way, the player has done a full clockwise circle, completing the whole outer rim of the map before doing these two. That might be the intended way. So let's try, let's try that, and I guess we'll find out. We'll, we'll see as we go along 
if uh, things could have potentially been messed up if we go one way or the other. I could have got two rocket guys, but I would much prefer to expand our firing line. I've got an idea. There's a hive down here. Okay, now that they're in place. So far, so good. Too bad. If I had the sniper down here, I would have him aim at these. Okay, it didn't actually do anything. I presumed all that was there to get rid of the brood nest. No priority target for spitters. Fantastic. I guess that means I can expect plasma grenadiers with no ability to priority target plasma grenadiers as well. I'm sure that's the next thing for us to find now that we have seen these. Dropships engaged elsewhere, sir. sir. Roger that. Marines ready. Roger that. Sir, affirmative. 
Sir. Yes, sir. Sir. This way. Marines here. Affirmative. Squad, ready to go. Look alive, squad. Marines ready. I have a chance. Oh my fucking god. All right. I thought I had more time to reposition them. Apparently not. How far back am I? I'm taking a break. I'll come back to this. All right. I got back to this part. He's going to be a little bit more careful here this time. What is this? Well, that certainly is new. I guess I was more right than I thought when I compared this map to Planet K. Now it just needs to do that, but like right under my feet. Squad ready, sir. Just needs to spawn bugs right underneath me. We'll see. Is it only a matter of time before <laughs> before it happens? Sir. Now, what was the trigger to do that? Was it because I took both of these out? I think the last time we only did this one. But yes, I kept them up here this time. They can just fire down from up there. Down to two. Well, that certainly is bad. It all worked out, though. would run up there, but this one is about to activate. Great, we could free the dropship from the mud at the hive entrance. You got something okay, don't know why it didn't listen to me there. There we go. Now, before I took that break, we decided we're going to go this way. Still no spitter priority target. Yes, sir. 
sir. Yes, sir. Squad ready, sir. Roger that. You got something for us to do. Sir? Our force support is moving. Squad ready. Roger that. Okay, just a nest, no big deal. There's the Plasma Grenadiers, right on cue. Okay, he's gone, good. Looks like there's brutness up here, but... The hive itself does not have any tunnels, so... Well, I want to see if there's anything back here. In case there's anything I can use supply-wise, but... Let's do this. Nope, nothing there. Squad ready, sir. This leads up into the main area. But we're not going that way. We'll go... We'll continue this way. Roger 
squad ready, sir. Well, that certainly isn't good. Could have been worse. That was not nearly that many drawn in from the top area. Scorpion hanging out back there. Squad ready, sir. This is definitely inconvenient positioning. Wow, this thing's an eight. Sir. All right, I would appreciate it if whatever bugs are up here would just leave me alone and get out of my way. But they don't seem to be. They don't seem to be wanting to do that. Okay, we did it. Ready to fly. Follow me, Marines. Miss me. One more clear. Squad ready, sir. Affirmative. Nothing else over here. Doesn't seem like it. this well I'm glad I came up here since there seems to be supplies waiting for me wow 
Wow, there's two of them? Okay. What the hell? All right. That takes care of that. Sir. Sir. Squad ready, sir. Okay, well, that tanker made things a little dicey there, but we we pulled it off. So the hive for that one is up there. Well, it's a good it's a good thing I didn't take any more steps forward or my prediction would have came true and this would have popped up right underneath my feet. Just patiently waiting for the fire to go away. Sir. Move up, but stay close. Roger that. Affirmative. I wonder what the trigger for that is. Walking over a specific area or something like that. Okay, how to do this? This might not be the best angle to tackle this area. 
Maybe it's better to come at it from this angle. But we're over here, so we gotta make it work. Either that or we just, instead of going up these stairs, we go over here to see if this is... This looks like a wider set of stairs, so maybe it is better. And we can capture this thing while we're over here. Great, we found tools to equip engineers. More power. Finally. So. So if we had never done this side objective, if we had never done this optional objective, we never would have got the ability to priority target spitters. Why, why are they not attacking? What are they doing? They're set to attack move, not move. And they're just walking into the jaws of the bugs. God damn it. I was hoping of all sides they were going to emerge from it wasn't going to be that side. Well, this couldn't be more inconvenient. You piece of shit tanker, do not put fire where I'm trying to respawn my units. Alright, fire, get out of here. Okay. Oh god, the sniper alerted them. Tell us what to do. Come on. Get over here, quickly. Or don't, you know, just do whatever you want, apparently. Roger that. 
Engineers report. Yeah, going from this side definitely was a lot easier than coming up these narrow stairs and trying to find a place up here. That's gonna be the hive. Construction complete. Engineers report. Construction complete. Tell us what to do. Engineers reporting. Sir. Tell us what to do. Squad ready, sir. Yes, sir. Sir. Engineers, follow me. Down to three.
engineers No, they're not going to make it in time. Damn it, they're still not gonna make it in time. Tell us what to do. Get back in there! There we go. Okay, another tanker. Okay, that's drones coming down from up there. Okay, where did they all come from? Guess they must have been hiding back here. Let's see, is there a nest? There is. going yes sir sir affirmative message sir comms here our war support has increased sir squadron sir affirmative roger that affirmative engineers follow me Capture the Southern Guard Post. Nice, what a well-equipped base. Oh, what's this? 
dropships on standby. Thank you for securing the area and stopping the endless arachnid invasion from the south. Stopping the what? You have to keep the base safe if you want to retain access to the remote control dropship we are operating from here. Troopers standing come on. Engineers report. Okay. Well, this confirms it. This confirms that absolutely clockwise around this thing is the intended direction. Because if you had gotten here, if you had gone this way instead of this way and you got here without the engineers, it wouldn't even be practical to hold this place. You would just have to abandon it. The best you could hope to do. Engineers reporting. Was to use the extra supplies we just got. And then leave and let your your supplies go into the negative. Construction complete. Because you would not be able to put defenses like this up to allow you to leave and keep the supplies. So it would either be you commit the supplies it gives you, which then there would be no point to keep the, the place anyways. If you're using the supplies you got from it just to, just to defend it. When all we're getting is another dropship. I mean, as is, I'm not convinced it's going to be able to hold anyways. Engineers reporting. Roger that. On the move. With me. On the move. Yeah, whatever. That base is not worth it. Sir, come on, 
engineers report. Sir. Alert. Bug attack inbound. Engineers reporting for We've got a unit under attack. Sir. We've got a unit under attack. Sir. Yes, sir. With the back squad moving in. Sir. We've got a unit under attack. Sir, Arachnids are disrupting one of our bases. You got something for us to kill? Squad ready. Come on, you ace! Yes, Engineers report. Theoretically. Theoretically, what could have happened is if we had come this way, gone to this place first, went into the negative with our supplies, then gone up to here and gotten the engineers, and suddenly we would not have been able to actually get the engineers because we would have been in the negative. So you wouldn't have been able to come down and use the Squad ready, sir. Tell us what to do. The ability to place turrets anyways. A unit has been promoted, sir. Like, going around this way could have put us in a situation that was extremely inconvenient. In which we would have had to come all the way back down here and reclaim this place. Because we were in the negative. Just to get an engineer. So that we would actually be able to use our war support. Let's take a peek. What's up here? According to console notes, these auxiliary power plants are necessary to boot up the power core. This fleet liaison doesn't even have the bombard ability. Tell us what to do. Stash your tools and move out. Sir. Yes, sir. Something tells me they're going to your orders? run into resistance doing this. You know, because the bombard ability is not available for some reason. That tells me that this, the orbital strike, is also not going to be available. Let's see if this is. 
No, all of their abilities are disabled for some reason. We've got a unit under attack. Where did that come from? What, what the fuck was that? Did that pop out of the ground over there? Just randomly? That is it. Sir. Random bugs ready. popping Sir. out of the ground is tied to you doing things like clearing the brood nests. Yeah, which absolutely a player that is more mobile, if they were trying to move forward, absolutely would have those bugs just pop up underneath their feet. Well, that worked. They managed to dodge that royal guard that was up there. Now that I've done that, Now that I've done that, do we? Yes, sir. Look alive, Roger that. Affirmative. Watch your charge. In there, sir. Okay, they just they can't hit them for some reason. What the fuck game? This is some bullshit. Yeah, why can nobody hit them up there? Yes, no, oh, what are you doing? Come on. Oh my fucking god. Of course. Standing by. Listen up. Roger that. Affirmative. Hold you an attack move, why are you not attacking? Oh my god, this area. Acknowledged. 
Roger that. Yes, sir. You got something for us to kill. Come on, tanker. Now, should we actually go up here like this, or should I just fast travel over to here and then go up here? There's surely more supplies around the map. This map is extremely long. It is very dense with content. Get into position. Negative seven, did we lose somebody? No, 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 that's not what happened. We gained extra supplies.
Okay, the hive is all the way over there. Spitter over there almost killed my snipers. Oh my god, spitters, get out of here. Oh, fantastic. We actually lost one. Garbage. And we're in the negative. That's right. God damn it. Well, we are nerfed a little now. Very unfortunate, but at least this thing is gone. No, they took too fucking long getting over there. Never mind. Okay, they pulled it off anyways. And the obligatory... Yeah. You see, if you had been coming at this area from this way and had been going up the hill this way, these absolutely would have popped up underneath your feet. 
Roger that. Move out. They were standing by something over here. I'm wondering if that's a hive. Sir. Order acknowledged. We got all the way down to zero for the supplies. This is good. So I could theoretically go back to that place, grab it, get the supplies, bring in new units, and then just fly us out of there. Yes, sir. It's happening. It's happening right now. I told you, it's a matter of time. But good, we survived the, the scorpion popping up right underneath our feet. Sir, let's go. Everybody fight. Sir, move out and scan for targets. Troopers, listen to Hawk and Jack. Move out. Near here. And these were the tents from the beginning of the game. You got something to follow me, Marines. Let's see what's up here. Nothing? Sir, affirmative. No secret supplies for me to gather. Follow me, no. Yes, sir. Affirmative. What about up here? Sir. <laughs> the way they scaled right there, that that definitely was not supposed to happen. Follow me, Marines. Roger that. Yes, sir. Look at that. There was an ammo cache up here for us. Our war support has increased, sir. Troopers, standing by. Affirmative. I don't feel like flying over there. We're just going to go up this way. Oh, more bugs popping up out of nowhere. Yeah, I mean, we obviously cleared this area out before, so it makes me wonder if, like, they respawn somehow. Affirmative. 
Ooh, we'd have to go through that big opening. Yes, sir. Okay, but we get more hidden supplies. It is nice that there are so many hidden supplies like this, but... You got <laughs> it also is rough that it feels like they are mandatory. It does not really feel optional at all. It feels like whatever we're building up to is going to be way more than you could handle if you did not go grab all this stuff. Alright, bugs, we got places to be. Come on. Oh, look at. Yep. Oh my god, no. Are you serious? What the fuck? Let's see what's down here. Probably the same thing. Probably a bunch more royal guards that you can't get good positioning on because you're going at something from a weird angle. Is there nothing here? Yes, this would be a perfect spot for some kind of objective because you have to go at it from such like a very specific area and it's blocked off from both sides. That would be a good spot to put something. Sniper, what are you doing? Get rid of this thing. Sniper, do something. Oh my god, I think the other thing broke too. And didn't fly. Yep, it did not work. Sir. 
So many tankers and royal guards and everything else. Why I'm not allowed to use Mark II's against all this, I don't know. <laughs> Why they have a fixation with wanting you to use power suit for the, the E-Pulse troopers, I don't know. Or popping out of the ground, why not? Okay, we're gonna try to continue this way. I'm supposed to capture whatever this thing is. Okay, it won't let me. Oh, that's probably... Oh, I think I cleared that. Just those bugs must have repopulated at some point. Get you the data center is closed and doesn't move. We need to find and activate the power core to bypass the lock. At least that is what the note here says. Thanks, Hacker Man. spawning bugs okay
Oh, there's more over there too. Fantastic. Construction complete. Orders? Look alive, troopers. Affirmative. Yes, sir. Construction complete. Please get us out of here. There should be a console in front of the gate to your left. Yes, sir. There definitely was a console here at some point. You know, I don't trust this. We're going up here. thing I stopped specifically right here because a royal guard would have popped up underneath my feet if I had taken even a couple more steps forward. Sir. Every random pop above bugs like that calls for another save. Alive, yes, sir. So if something goes wrong, it doesn't have to potentially happen to me again. In a, in a more inconvenient circumstance kind of thing. Like in case I forget about it and then I do take that extra step forward. Promoted, sir. We repaired the power core and could boost up the dropship's engines. We could also activate the landing beacon for the drop zone. Reading you, yes, 
Dropships on standby. Ready for orders. With the power core online, we can now access the data center. We're gonna explore the rest of this ridge first before we do anything else. That's a bunch more bugs that respawned at some point. Okay, nowhere near where I wanted them to move. Rockets, we're up. Well, I was hoping to find more supplies as we went around this perimeter, but no luck. No luck yet. More ammunition, though. That's good. Our war support has increased, sir. All right, let's get out of here. Roger that. We've lost contact with the comms base. Yes, sir.
Mission success. Ready to fight. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Where are they all going? Oh, into the fire for some reason, apparently. What the hell are they doing? All right, now that we've maximized the size of our of our force, we can save again and we can get rid of whatever this hive is down here. Sir. Yes, sir. That's a big one. All right, this might be pretty intense. Of course, there's a goddamn tanker right there as soon as I decide to advance on this area. And they walk right through the goddamn fire. Okay. Troopers, 
Standing by. Squad moving sir. out. Yes, sir. Sir. Yes, sir. Sir. Roger that. Listen up. Roger that. Standing by. Affirmative. Move out. Sir. Yes, sir. Move up, squad. Sir. I have a feeling this might have been supposed to be the final hive of this mission and we're just doing it early perhaps possibly The randomly respawning bugs finally activated over there. Okay, for some reason it doesn't like me standing right there. Oh my god, it doesn't like me standing there either. That's bad. Gonna be close. Should be plenty of time to beat this one. You got something for us, yes, sir. They did it. Fantastic. <laughs> Random bugs popping out of the ground now. See, at some point I'm probably supposed to go capture that. Look alive, squad. Yes, sir. Roger that. Move out. Scan for targets. On the ground. Affirmative. Roger that. Yes, sir. Sir. 
Let's see, what's up here? More ammunition, how nice. We have almost explored the entirety of this perimeter. Which I am sure this area is a base defense section, considering there's these turrets up there that you can capture. So the idea is we need to get all the war support possible before then. I don't care if it's heavy. Move out. And then we will build all the turrets there and then also capture the ones they have. We found another hive in a very inconvenient area to pass through. they can get rid of the tanker before we go over there, that's going to be much more convenient. There we go. Are they going? Well, this one doesn't have any tunnels associated with it, so it should be easy to clear. Since you cleared all hives in the area, we also have detected a major decrease in bug activity in your south. Oh! Good thing we stopped those waves. Now we can use our resources elsewhere. Okay, that's good to know. Look alive, squad. Okay, I mean, we're going to have to do a lot of walking because of that. We're going to have to walk all the way over there. Grab it and walk back. I mean, we are in the negative. We could just not go back and deal with it. We would only get one more set of uh, troops out of it anyways, since we were gaming the system, but that's good to know. I see. We'll have to go up there at some point. No priority tankers. 
So I can't do rocket launchers and have it priority tankers or anything like that. In case there are some in this uh, inevitable base defense section that we're about to participate in. You got something, you got something. Roger that. Construction complete. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Look alive, squad. Roger that. Sir. Construction complete. Standing by. Yes, sir. Look alive, troopers. Roger that. Sir. Yes, sir. Listen up. Roger that. Rockets, we're up. Yes, sir. Fleet is ready. Roger that. Reading you. Five by five. Get into position. Orders? Get your gear. We're moving out. Sir. Standing by. With me. Sir. Yes, sir. Look alive, squad. Affirmative. Yes, sir. You got something for us to kill? On the ground. Okay, that's good enough for a defensive line. Follow me, Marines. Affirmative. Sophisticated data center doorbell. Hackerman is hiding in his data center. Hey, Hackerman, it's Nocklu. I need your assistance to hack the prison gates open. Please come out. If it isn't my favorite student, I am glad to assist. Do you remember my old AI escort? Time to dust it off. Wise beep. Location marking beep. Okay, yeah. If I didn't point it out earlier, that is Hackerman from, uh, from Kung Fury. I think starting up your pet's reactor, uh... Pissed off the bugs or something. Okay, it pointed towards the innocuous tunnel. Let's see. Oh. Shit. Too early. Yeah, reactor annoyed some bugs. Sir, Intel Sir. reports a new bug threat in our sector. Sir? Sir? Yes, sir. Sir. Ready to fight. Rockets, we're up! I see all these tunnels turned. Too bad I can't use the, uh, the fleet thing. Sure would be nice here.
I waited too long. They potentially could have got in there. Randomly respawning bugs decided to become problematic again. Okay, it was only these four, apparently. Marines, Roger that. Your orders? Marines ready. Okay, for your thoughts. You're in charge. For now. Troopers, watch your back. Standing by. On the move. Sir. Yes, sir. Look alive. Roger that. Please pull back your units so that I can hack in peace. Sir. Okay. What is this? There is no console to hack here. Squad, move up. Sir. Okay, uh, well, I could hack my pet to blow up the gates with this reactor. I can just build an upgrade. Okay, whatever it's saying. Instant self-destruct beep. AI heard me gotta run. Uh, is Hacker Man dead? Oh, yep, he's dead. Oh my god, there's so much going on. We're gonna lose these people because it keeps pulling me away. Thank you for getting me out of there, hello? I need to evacuate with my special ship. Okay, accommodates my special cargo, but the path, okay. Gate has been locked due to emergency shutdown. Function triggered by friends of bug hives in the area. Clear them out. Did anybody die when it kept pulling my attention over here so we kept missing stuff? I, I don't know. Someone could have died. Maybe no one did.
Okay, they almost died going down there, but they pulled it off. All eyes have been cleared. All the gates to the central tower are opening. Be gone, infinitely respawning scorpion. Sir. Sir. Stash your tools and move okay, out. now we gotta get up here. Me. Oh, we just take this bridge. Okay. That makes sense. I, uh, Major, I think I owe you an explanation about what is going on here. What do you mean? I am here to get you off this planet. Stash your tools and move out. I am thankful for your assistance, but you need to know of the dangers that lie ahead. In front of us, there is a central core of the Maxima system. The Maxima system was designed to capture particles from the atmosphere unique to this planet. The facility in the area are used to condense these particles into a serum that hardens arachnid exoskeletons and makes them docile. I don't like where this is going. Well, yes, the docile point went wrong. The bugs were faking it and caused havoc a few weeks ago. How entirely unexpected of such a, an experiment to go wrong. I will let that s snark slide for once ahead of you. You'll have to face something. I suggest using the shutdown terminal to disable the Maxima system to increase our chances of survival, but be prepared to run or die. Okay. All right, I guess I'm reloading. Okay, guess I'm reloading. What's the situation? Affirmative. On the prowl. Snipers. Ready to go. And they... Because of the traffic gate, that's why. They just ignore flares. How awful. 
<laughs> how how positively awful. Okay. We've got a unit under attack. Oh, we can't even run that way. Okay. What are we even supposed to do then? What's the point? We can't even go in a circle. Oh, we can barely go in a circle. What the fuck is this? All right. All right, who wants to be... Who wants to be sacrifice bait? This is fucking stupid. Oh my god. Where's the fight? Let's get locked and load. Shutdown sequence for the Maxima system has been activated, but yet again, bugs are stopping our efforts. They have interrupted energy conduits crucial for the shutdown and resettled nearby. Look like. Looks like you have another cleaning job to do. Where? All the way over there? Why? Why are we doing this? Why is this not the end of the mission? Oh my god. Are you joking? What the fuck? I'm taking another break. I can't do this. <laughs> I, I feel like I just played through an entire map and they told me I have to I have to do it over. Go back, do it again. No, thank you. All right. I'm going to come back to this like tomorrow or something, okay? Okay. I am back from my break. Let's talk about, let's talk about this map for a little bit. Just recap everything that has gone on in my, my thoughts about it so far. So, this map is very well done. One by just the map maker in general. The one who designed the map and the one who published the map that did all the triggers for it. It is very, very well done. I do think around here is where the map started, right? We started here. Oh yeah, that that's what this was used for. I was like, this would be a perfect place to, to put something, but that's actually where we started. Yeah, I do think Players, a lot of players are going to have trouble with this introduction. I think what is going to happen is they're going to come out. We've got a unit under attack. I think they're going to come out. Where do you need us? Sir. Yes, sir. Standing by. Okay, nobody needs healing. I think they're going to walk out here, take some damage to those bugs that were right here and they're going to soft lock themselves immediately. They won't be able to clear this area after taking some damage here. And that, I am sure, is going to frustrate a lot of players. I think the entire first section before you get this is probably going to frustrate a lot of players. I think also, I think we got lucky for a lot of this. Choosing to go this way, I think, was lucky that we chose the right path to take. I think it would have been a very different experience going down this way and around. Because even though it said that we could go about this any way we wanted, going down this way, triggering these things in a different order, 
it would have been a less satisfying order to do it in. Going down here, grabbing this, not having the engineers for it, going up here, getting the engineers, maybe being in the negative, going up to here, it telling you that you need the engineers, you still don't have the engineers because you're in the negative. It would be frustrating as a player if that happened to you. We've got a unit under attack. Aside from that, these randomly spawning bugs. I think we also have gotten lucky, very lucky, when it comes to those randomly spawning bugs. I think those have the potential to pop up underneath the player in a lot of places, and we have just gotten lucky that it has not happened in any egregious way to us. But the potential for it to happen there, like that, is there. And if that does happen, players would get frustrated. This area, I can tell, like, uh, there's a lot of ideas in this map. I can tell the the one who designed all the, all the triggers had a lot of ideas for this map, and they decided to throw all of them in, right? Like, they threw in every... At least almost every idea they had. Which this is a unique idea. The the immortal bugs. You need to get to the, the special escape ship or the uh, just to activate this console. And these things are in your way. I think it is maybe a little too claustrophobic here. Like there's not enough room to move. Maybe for an idea like this, but it is interesting. But yeah, aside from that, what I meant by they threw in all the ideas they had like what we are doing now with these extra these extra tunnels popping up right this feels like it was like a different idea they have for the map and they they threw it in at the end as well right like it feels like we're almost doing two maps at this point like two entirely different ideas for the map we completed the first idea which was going around completing all the objectives and getting to here and now this feels like a secondary idea that they had for the map that they threw in as well which might make it a little too long for most people's tastes I think but but it is interesting it might be one of those things where like if this was split into two maybe when you get to here There would be like a part two to the map where the map is is set during the night or something. Just to give the, the player like a little bit of a break. Because right now, it are, we already have been doing this map for multiple hours. And uh, since we're going and clearing hives that we already cleared, it could get a little bit grating for new players or uh, for players that are doing this. They could definitely, they could definitely get burnt out on the map at this point when they, when they see they have to go and clear more hives that they have already done. But aside from all that, this is, like I said, a very well done map. It is obvious there was a ton of time put into this. Not only by the map designer, but the, the trigger, the trigger designer as well. And for this being their first map, it is extremely impressive. Right? That this is their, their first go at actually publishing a map where they did all the triggers for it like this. It is extremely impressive. I'm reloading so that Sir. <laughs> I'm reloading because I want to go over to this one when it's still not at full strength.
We've got a unit under attack. Oh, well, they're dead. I didn't realize that was going on over there, but too late now. They're going to get chomped. Bugs popping underneath, popping up underneath their feet. God damn it. No, that is not what I wanted to do. God fucking damn it. No, we're reloading. Ow. Abysmally inconvenient when I tried to select them to move so they didn't get chomped. Everybody else moved, walking into the fire and everything else too. Awaiting orders. Stash your tools, and engineers. Move follow me. Stash your tools and move out. out. Yes, sir. God, this area fucking sucks to get through. Engineers, We're going this way. Me. Plasma launch detected. Engineers, follow me. Sir. Sir. Affirmative. Ready here, sir. We've got a unit sure. under attack. What the god damn it? Why did they go this way? Whatever. You know what? I'm reloading again. I was about to say they deserve to die, which they do, for going that way. But we're reloading again. Sir, yes, sir. Get your gear. We're moving it all ass. Yeah, the the infinitely respawning bugs I don't like. Especially when it's things like like you're not even letting me use Mark II's, but you're gonna infinitely respawn royal guards all over the map the whole time. It's it's like it's more than a bit much. It's way too much to do that. Where's the fight? These goddamn spitter bugs. Mm. 
We're saving again. I don't even want to get over here again. If things go bad. Wow, this is just <laughs> fucking awful. Look at all this. Yeah, and flight pads for us to use is nice, but they it, it'd be nicer if they were in areas that uh that actually weren't covered in fog of war. That sure is a lot of Royal Guards. Yeah, this map is probably... I mean, part of the reason is you're restricting the player, right? A, a little bit of it is artificial difficulty because you're not letting the player use the entire arsenal that the game allows you to use. Squad ready, sir. But even besides that, like the amount of royal guards and everything else that is constantly throwing at the player is definitely going to challenge players a lot. That was there the whole time too, huh? I was wondering where that thing was, but that explains it. It's actually at the three hives. Somebody go up there and grab Orders, it. Lieutenant. Roger that. Snipers are ready. 
Let's just be glad nobody died from that. Great, you already cleared one out. Sir. Yes, sir. Ready here. On the bounce. Lock and load. Watch his face. I'm doing my part. All right, let's go ahead and piss off the bugs. That's a lot of plasma grenadiers. All I can do is priority Royal Guard. They never gave me the ability to priority plasma grenadiers or tankers. That was awfully rude, Scorpion. Okay, good. They can't hit them from there. And they're dead. Squad ready, sir. God damn it, that guy's gonna fucking die, because why is he running that way? Squad ready, sir. Yes, sir. The terrain over here is not, not so convenient for us. Ready, 
I could build more turrets as well, but there's no real need to at the moment. I gotta get close enough to activate this thing. But I don't want to go here. This is not close enough to activate it. Okay, I think that's it. I think we did it. Well, as long as they can get in there in time. Okay, they did it. They did get a little chomped, but that's okay. Only one more and we can put an end to this mess. Sir. Orders, Lieutenant. Rockets, we're up. Squad, ready for orders. Good shot, troopers. Get those launchers moving. Yes, sir. 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 Roger that. Roger that. Ready. Roger 
Drone's base is operational, sir. What should we add? Dropships engaged elsewhere, sir. That's what I want. A bunch of rocket troopers. Why not? Patiently wait. And then we'll head to the final zone. Oh, that's a nice addition. Look at that. It actually tells you how long it's going to take up there. So there's two of them around here. We just can only see one. Rockets, we're up. Come on. Yes, sir. Come on, you wings. Hey, we have our abilities back. Yeah, so when it was saying like mobile, whatever, remote controlled thing, it actually was referring to the fleet liaison's abilities. You only maintain control of them. I always like, because we got a drum ship as well, I presume that's what it was talking about, but I guess it also gives us the fleet liaison's abilities. Rockets, we're up. Squad moving out. Yeah, just walk through the fire. Why not? Even though I told you to come all the way over here. Oh, they're stacked right on top of each other. I see. Well, that takes care of them.
Okay, the hive's all the way over there. Yeah, this is not great positioning. I think coming at this place from the other way would be a lot more effective. Ready, sir. Roger that. But we're already over here. Let's go. I don't remember which way the bugs pop out of this particular hole either. Right in front of us, that's where they pop out. So if that's the case, we want to position ourselves past it. I'm just saving again in case this goes bad. capture this one without even taking the hive. Conduits have been unclogged. The Maxima system is shutting down. Three elites are vulnerable now, but the Maxima Rex is a different story. It has been overfed with the Maxima formula. The compound's emergency beacon can now be activated to call in the safeguard unit from the autonomous satellite. The safeguard unit was designed to withstand the Maxima enhanced bugs for a limited time, so use it to distract the Maxima racks while I extract, presumably. I didn't actually see what it said. Where the hell are they going?
squad ready. Sergeant that. Okay, they're not exactly the fastest at clearing hives, but they'll get it done. Okay. Of course. They couldn't let us just leave in peace. Yeah, that was the thing that had the gate. That is what it's talking about, I presume. Oh, what destroyed the other one? Or is it just covered by the fog of war? That might be the case. Come on, everybody pile out. Rockets, we're up. Roger that. Come on, you apes. Let's get some fun. I'm doing my sir. part. Roger that. Sir. Yes, sir. Infantry, standing Get into line. position. Troopers, standing yes, sir. Look alive. Troopers. Affirmative. Sir. Yes, sir. Sir, good to go. Awaiting orders. This way. Rockets, we're up. Roger that. Sir. Lock and load. Watch the spaces. Open out. Receiving signal deploying Avatar 2BX? Protection time limit? That's a very short time to spring that on me. What if this guy wasn't even over here?
Good job, Major. I'll be off with the samples we need to both enhance it and create a countermeasure. You can expect a promotion soon. Okay, we did it. We completed the mission. Yeah, that la that last section wasn't as long as I thought it was going to be, but it definitely tacked on quite a bit of time to the mission. But yes, this actually this was a a very well done map both in terms of the design that that both contributors did. Contributors did. The triggers and the map design. This is this is actually what I was hoping for, right? That those that just want to design maps can do template maps, and those that are more interested in the trigger work can do that if they're not interested in the other part of the design process for these. This is the perfect example of what can be created when those two halves come together. So it's great to see this actually being done. So I do hope we get to see more from this creator. I hope that more template maps are introduced as well for those that don't want to do the triggers but just want to design maps. But yes, this was, this was very well done from both aspects. And that is where I am calling it. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.